Taking a look at matters pertaining to national defense, some 10,000 U.S. troops are participating in the annual combined military training between Seoul and Washington. The regularly scheduled exercise held to sharpen defense readiness against threats from up north of the border continue until the end of April. Kim Jong-soo tells us what the full legal drills are all about. An official from South Korea's Combined Forces Command told reporters on Friday that a combined 10,000 U.S. troops will participate in the annual Four Eagle exercise alongside South Korea's 290,000 troops, bringing the total number of participants to 300,000. Of the 10,000 participating American troops, 3,600 service members have been deployed from the U.S. mainland. Full Eagle is a field training exercise that involves ground, air, naval, and special forces. It is connected to the key resolve drills that begin on March 13th, which are computer simulated command post exercises conducted by the U.S. South Korea Alliance. It's also been reported that the Nimitz class supercarrier USS Carl Vinson will arrive in Busan on March 15th to participate in this year's key resolve exercise. Many believe the nuclear-powered aircraft carrier has been deployed to send a warning signal to North Korea. Although the bilateral exercises have been carried out numerous times under various circumstances, there is no doubt that tensions are running particularly high this year. In the wake of North Korea's latest missile test on February 12th and the apparent assassination of Kim Jong-nam on February 13th. On Thursday, just a day after the Four Eagle exercise had begun, North Korea's state-run Korean Central News Agency issued a statement promising a, quote, merciless response. Should the U.S. imperialists and the South Korean puppet forces fire even a single shell into the waters where the sovereignty of our republic is exercised, the Korean People's Army will immediately launch its merciless military counteractions. That same day, South Korean officials promised a strong response if necessary, but reiterated the long-standing position that the military maneuvers are purely defensive in nature and not, as North Korea often alleges, a rehearsal for invasion. The annual exercises are meant to test and improve the defense capacities of the South Korea-U.S. alliance should a crisis situation occur. Kim Jong-soo, Arirang News.